Hey guys, welcome back to HFE. And in this week's video, we're gonna be testing out what food source attracts deer the best. We have starting from the cheapest all the way to the most expensive deer product we can find. We also have molasses and deer cane for our own little experiment we're gonna do on the side. And to doc document this experiment, we're gonna be using the Tacticam Reveal SK. This is one of the best cameras I've ever used personally, and I think it's the best on the market today. So if you could get a chance to get one, I highly recommend it. What we're gonna be doing in this video is we're gonna be taking each of these, putting them in a straight line in front of the trail camera, and at night we're gonna see which deer go to which pile first and everything like that. And we're gonna have our own little track down the side like I mentioned before to see if that's gonna impact what the deer do. All right guys, so we're gonna to get to it. And starting with the cheapest bag, we have uh, cracked corn, which is going at $4.99 for a 40 pound bag. In the middle here, we have an Agway Special, which is $14.99 for the bag. It's an apple scented deer attractant. And at the end here, we have Trophy Image. And it's their own brand. They say they claim to be the best. And that's at $35 for the bag. All right, guys, we're going to get this all set up and get rolling with the images. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so we just put down the food sources. Over here, we have the cheapest one, uh, the cracked corn. We have the middle one here. Uh, the apple scented corn and over here we have the best of the best the premium stuff and uh, We also have back here Our little concoction that we made all right So this we're gonna see which one does the best and the best bang for your buck Is it worth it going with the cheap stuff or is it worth it going with the most expensive stuff you can find? Well, let's find out we're gonna turn on the tacticam here And we're gonna see what happens over the next couple days and we'll get back to you all right guys, so it's been about a week now and I've received close to a thousand pictures from the Tactic Ham Reveal SK. And to my surprise, the one uh, food source just blew all the others out of the water. And uh, I mean, that's why we do this kind of testing to see what attracts deer the best and everything like that. So let's dive on in and take a look and see what action we were getting. So as you guys can see here in the first video, within an hour of us setting up, a doe moseyed her way on in and decided to take the bait. So when this doe came in, it took her a little bit to decide which uh, food pile she wanted to go to first. But when she made up her mind, she went right for the middle one, which is the Agway Special, the apple scented corn. Uh, then another doe decided to come on in here. And she was making up her mind as well, deciding on which pile she wanted to go for, which one caught her attraction. She started heading over towards the cracked corn, but then she changed her mind. And we found ourselves right back in the middle here with the apple scented corn from Agway. Then proceeded into night and uh, another doe came out. Could have been one of the same does we saw earlier. But uh, she started heading her way right on over to the middle pile again for the Agway uh, apple scented corn. Finally, another deer came out and they decided to choose the trophy image uh, deer pellets. Then again, but afterwards, she decided to go right over for that apple scented corn. Uh, she tried the deer pellets and then went right over to it. The next day, uh, we had another deer come in and it went right over for the trophy image. As you can see here, a mom and her two fawns. The mom is currently uh, eating on that apple scented corn from Agway. And the other does, or the fawns, are just moseying around as the one fawn actually heads over towards the trophy image. But we kept getting the same results over and over again. A uh, doe would come in, she'd go for the apple scented, then another doe would come in, they'd go for the trophy image. Um, the fawn, again, a mother and fawn going for the apple scented corn. And it was a no-brainer. You could see here that the apple scented corn's now gone, but the fawn's still eating from it. Once the apple scented corn was gone, they headed right on over to that trophy image. And as you guys could see here and everything, like every once the apple scented corn was gone, they went right over to that trophy image. And a couple squirrels only ate the cracked corn. 
And even with that uh, apple scented Courtney gun, the so mother and father will go back and try looking for some scraps there. Over left. a thousand pictures and videos sent to my phone from the Tacticam Reveal SK. In first place is the Agway Special, the apple scented corn for $14.99 a bag. In second place is the Trophy Image. Uh, for $35 a bag, and in third place is the cracked corn uh, for $4.99 a bag. Now, every time the deer came in, they almost likely went right to the apple scented corn, but there was some times where they went over the trophy image, but then later on throughout their um, stay there, they go right over to that apple scented corn. As you guys even saw in here, once the apple scented corn was gone, they still went to that area, and then they started going over to the trophy image. Now I'm not uh, dissing on the uh, trophy image at all, um, but it's the bet for my perspective for nutrition and everything. The trophy image was number one, but that wasn't the test here this week. This week was to determine whether or not uh, which food source was the best one for attracting deer, and the apple scented corn blew away. I mean, the cracked corn we thought for sure was going to get some attention, but no deer went to it except for a couple squirrels. Uh, the deer just cl stayed clear away from that and uh, our little concoction that we made didn't even work at all either so I mean it was just a clear winner out of the water who won but I mean getting back to the question I so asked you guys in the beginning of the video which food source would work back from the cheapest to most expensive it's dead smack in the middle with the 1499 bag well that's why we test this stuff here guys to see which works the best and uh, to get real world tests instead of listening to commercials and everything like that we want to put it on the ground and do it in the field and get the best studies and the facts and that's what you guys saw here today so thank you guys so much for tuning in this week um, please be sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for hfe outdoors